being homeless in Jackson is more than not having a home to come to at night. It's not knowing the simple luxury of a warm shower or the comfort of a soft bed or even a family to come home to and tell about their day. It can be lonesome, but one morning per week, those worries are pushed aside and replaced with laughter on Capitol Street. Volunteers at the nonprofit group HeartWorks at the Stew Pot say they aim to project God's love, providing friendship and building self-confidence through art lessons and self-expression. Well, I think it's important. Everyone wants to be missed when they're not there. Everyone wants an appointment. Everyone wants someone to know their name. Everyone wants to have an intelligent conversation. Uh, everyone wants to share themselves with someone that cares. Uh, talk about your day, talk about your goals, and really that's why we're here. Art is a fantastic byproduct, but it's really about the fellowship. It's really about growing those relationships, the friendships we have, the pat on the shoulder, the name recognition, the encouragement that this fellowship brings to both sides, to the volunteers as well as the artists. Each Tuesday, participants are given a different theme by which they paint. This week, they put oil to canvas, illustrating historical spots from the Capitol's downtown. Like it, it, it relates to you and keep your mind occupied. It's uh, so I like, it. and I've been coming here a long time. Okay. Do you come every Tuesday? Some Tuesday, but, I, but I'm start gonna come. And I and and I've and I've been coming here a long time. So I like. It. Yes, Do you look forward to it? Yes, ma'am. It keeps me occupied, keep my mind focused on what I'm doing and stuff. Yes, ma'am. A lady over here said that painting is very soothing for her. I have to say it's soothing for me, too. It yeah, so and it's fun. Mm -hmm. yeah. What time do you get, whenever you come here on Tuesdays, what time do you show up? Oh, uh, by 8 o'clock. About 8 o'clock, okay. Yeah, So, do you get here early? I get here early. They eat breakfast, they feed us breakfast. And we start art by 9 o'clock, and we do by 10.30. Founder Stacy Underwood says the artworks are for sale at just $5 a piece, which helps to furnish art supplies and snacks. With less than a handful of volunteers, however, and slim donations for art supplies, Heartworks organizers sometimes struggle to make it happen every Tuesday. She says one artist there keeps asking her, have any of my paintings sold yet? She says she regretfully tells them no. She says she'd love to see local businesses and restaurants showcasing these artworks to the public, which would help the good cause. These paintings hung alongside the artwork of other artists would provide balanced representation of local talent, she says. To get your hands on one of these works of art and to keep the program going or to volunteer on a Tuesday, just go to heartworksms.com and check it out. In Jackson, Tara Thomas, WJTV12.